I just finished doing that KFC order, right? And the, the customer made sure they gave me a zero tip. Take a look. Don't be that guy. It is currently 10 degrees in Brooklyn, y'all. 10 degrees in Brooklyn. And I'm heading to the gym, but uh, I'm thinking about making some money doing this door dashing thing. I haven't door dashed in a while. And I was like, you know what? Instead of just going to the gym, why not make some money from this? <laughs> so my crazy behind is about to get in my car after I uh, get my workout on in this 10 degree weather and serve that demand because I know a lot of people in Brooklyn is about to hibernate today. So you know what I'm about to do? I'm about to get in that car, turn that gas on, fill up that car. You know what I'm saying? Turn the car on, get in that whip and see what kind of bread I can make in the freezing cold. You see me? Look. See, I got on one of those coats to where, you know, you bought the coat 10 years ago. And when you bought the coat, you was like, yeah, I'm never gonna have to buy a coat again. This is one of these coats. This is a giant coat I got on right here. Got the Eskimo. I got the Eskimo look right now. And well, let's see what's going on today. After I get this workout in, of course. Normally when you door dash, you gotta be consistent so you can set your own schedule and just dash whenever. But uh, since I haven't dashed in a long time, I don't have that privilege right now, so. I'm over here, poop, 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 poop. <laughs> it is definitely that cold. I feel like I'm upstate New York back in school right now. But yeah, definitely. Uh, so because I don't have those privileges, a time like this is one, some of the only time I can just jump in and not schedule because the demand is so high. It's gonna be entertaining, I guess. <laughs> My hands feeling it already. You gotta do what others won't do to get what others can't have. You know what I'm saying? You gotta be willing to put in that work. So that's what I'm doing. I'm putting in a little work. Let's see how much money I can work up for uh, some uh, play money in Thailand. I wanna go to Thailand. So guys, I'm done working out and all of that stuff and I waited, I waited until it hit dinner time basically. It's uh, going into dinner time right now, it's 4.02. 403 I should say right 403 and um the reason why I wait is because uh when you don't dash in a long time you have to schedule yourself I want to work in a specific location okay so I didn't want to schedule somewhere I didn't want to work but now that it's busy in my location I'm about to get it popping let's do this matter of fact I think I'm gonna get some gas first then we're gonna get it popping so I've got some gas and I'm starting my dash and uh right now 24 degrees in Brooklyn so not quite the start of uh, the 10 degrees that it was this morning and then warmed up a little bit so that's that's good news for for me people still don't want to leave their house so it's all good let's get this cold dashing started <laughs> man I feel like a rookie all over again man I haven't done this in forever I got my first delivery to take over here to I don't even know where I'm going yet but uh first one is alcohol It's cold out, so I understand. They need they sippy sip. <laughs> we out. <laughs> so I made a smooth twelve dollars on that first dash. It took me thirty-one minutes though. That's not good. That's not good. But we gotta try to make at least what twelve more dollars to make it thirty. Well, I, what was it? We gotta make at least eight more dollars to make it twenty dollars for an hour, right? Let's go. Let's go. We got a thirty. What? No, not even thirty. Twenty-eight minutes to go to make this hour worth it. It's already getting dark and I'm on my second delivery. It took long enough to get back to this side of Brooklyn. But I don't even know if you can see that. I got some groceries. It's like a $23 order right here. So let's get this money. Groceries gone. And uh, so far, I think my total for that one is only about $16.75 right now. And after I picked up those groceries, I picked up another order. It's been about an hour and a half, and 
and I'm just finishing up my third order. It was a lot of traffic in Brooklyn, but it's, you know, it's six o'clock on a Saturday, so that's kind of expected. But guys, you don't want this to be your only income. Okay, you want to diversify your income. I don't know if you watch my channel at all, but I also, I also talk about crypto. These are unconventional ways. It's not the regular way people make money on uh, crypto. It's not the, let's say, maybe the most popular or the sexiest way, but it's passive residual income. Okay, passive residual income. I don't know if you're one to like passive residual income, but if you go wake up every single day to money increasing, or hey, shoot, once a week to your money increasing, why not, you know? You want to diversify your income. You don't want to keep all your eggs in one basket. Say you're doing DoorDash and all of a sudden you use a car, right? I'm using a car. What? God forbid, you know, but you know, not wishing nothing bad on anybody but what if your car stops running the right way and that's your only stream of income you don't want to leave it to your car always being fixed you know what i mean to have a source of income for yourself you definitely want to diversify your income and i am making sure that i don't hit anything as i'm talking to y'all <laughs> we get it on in brooklyn but yeah guys Look at the other videos on my channel and see if it's anything that you might be into so you can start diversifying your income and not just relying on DoorDash or any other app, you know? Don't rely on any one thing <clears throat> so you can pay your, to pay your bills with, you know? Don't rely on any one thing at all. Diversify, have multiple streams of income, maybe let's do that. And I'm doing my third delivery right now. And let's see how much my total after this third delivery will be. Went to the Slutty Vegan. That's the name of the spot. <laughs> so, so far in this dash, making 20, made $27.34 plus that $12 from earlier. So, what's that? Uh, $39.34. That's not too bad. It's looking like almost $16 an hour. Eh, we could do a little better, right? Maybe when the traffic gets better, it'll be a little bit easier to dash out here and make a little bit more money faster. Let's see. So I just finished another dash. It was 38. Let me see if I can get it right. This thing is crazy. That dash brought my total for this dash. 38.09, if y'all can see it, if it would focus for me. Yeah, 38.09 is the total plus that $12 which puts me at $50.09 for basically, how many hours is that? 4.30 to, it's 7.12 right now. So if it was, you know, 7.30, that'd be three hours, $50. What's that per hour? Not instead of doing math in my head, in three hours, I basically made, there we go, $16.69 per hour. That's not too bad, you know, can't complain about that. My gas was $40, so at least I paid for my gas so far. <laughs> and $10 to spare, so now I can buy a sandwich at the store. This, I'm thinking about probably stopping, uh, I'm, I'm trying to hit this sweet spot. I'm trying to hit it, you know, around like uh, eight o'clock to see how it feels. I got about 45 more minutes, 47 more minutes to be exact to go before I hit eight o'clock. That's like the sweet spot to me. It's less traffic and more money because people are definitely not trying to leave the house. But uh, yeah, we're gonna see how that goes. I'm gonna hang in there until eight o'clock and see how it goes. I'm so far off went from where I was dashing from. So they're gonna send me all the way back, but have me dash along the way. So uh, yeah, 1669, that's where the money is at right now per hour, three hours of dashing. Yeah, so it got a little bit crazy, and it's 8.15 right now. And uh, I'm actually on the phone with my cousin as I'm doing this video. He yelling at me. <laughs> but nah, so uh, <laughs> so my balance right now is 61.34 for almost four hours of work. So it seems like it's just about the same. 16.34. 61. Oh, wow, I said 16. 61.34. Uh, I'm trying to decide whether to keep going or to call it quits. We'll see. We'll find out. But I'm way further from where I'm. 
I, I wanted to dash. Let me go over there and see if I uh, have any more dashing left in me for the day. Because I'm ready to go get myself something to eat and call it a day already. On a home stretch. About to go to KFC and pick somebody's meal up. Home stretch. This would make $91. KFC order, right? And the, the customer made sure they gave me a zero tip. Take a look. Don't be that guy. If you go order DoorDash, Uber Eats, and all that stuff, these people are out here working for a living. You're not going to give them any tip? Make sure you tip your drivers, all right? I took it because it was a stacked order. And, you know, like I said, I haven't done this in a long time, so my eye isn't even sharp like it used to be. I mean, if I would have saw that, and noticed that it had no tip, I would have rejected it. But just a heads up, if you, I'm gonna say it again, if you order from DoorDash and Uber Eats, make sure that you tip your drivers, all right? So guys, I'm gonna end the dash here. I was aiming for $100, but I got stopped short at 92. 92 bucks, 92 bucks. Right now, I'm about to go order me some Thai food. So it was cool for my first run in, in, in like at least two years. Uh, about a year and a half uh, that I actually ran through like one time I did it just to do it and that was about one delivery literally like two two deliveries and uh, that was cool I made like $28 but this is the first time I've done it for like hours on end uh, for, you know, for a long time so $92 in about uh, let's see six hours so it's not too bad it's not too it's not the worst but it's not the best but uh, yeah, guys, listen, I appreciate you watching. Thank you. You know what I mean? Hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. Hit that bell for notifications. I'm on Instagram. I'm on, obviously, YouTube. For those of you who like to play NBA 2K and like to get on Twitch at all, I'm on there. All of the links are in the description below. I can barely think straight now. I'm ready to eat, get in the house. <laughs> this is your boy, Troy, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.